As prom season inches closer, many high school seniors are looking forward to their big night and fun with friends. But for some with special needs, prom can be tricky. Jacqueline Kovacs sp spoke with one mom who decided to make things a bit easier. She joins us live now with those details. Jackie. Mel, a Ferndale mother, decided to give her son his very own prom, knowing that he wouldn't be able to attend his own school's dance because of his epilepsy. What she didn't expect was the idea to turn into a full-blown event for another of a number of other people. Carrie Boyer's sons were born prematurely at 24 weeks. Her son Charles faces a number of challenges every day because of his cerebral palsy and epilepsy. Because of his health issues, Carrie chose to give Charles his own prom. There's a lot of children that don't get to go to prom. Um, a lot of special needs kids, you know, due to needing one-on-one -on -one, um, care, they just can't do it. So we decided, why don't we throw him his own prom? Um, and then he can, we can invite all the special needs children to come. The idea started with Charles, but now the event will be held for anybody with special needs. I honestly didn't think it would get this big. I really didn't. Um, you know, when we first talked about it, we just kind of thought, throw Charles a party. You know, just kind of all of our friends and family get together and throw Charles a party and be like his prom. Um, and then the more, like, that it, the word got out there and I was telling people about it, it's turning into huge a prom for everybody our fairy tale prom will be held at the end of may at our son's banquet hall in johnstown several community members have already come together to help but more is still needed a number or the dance will be open to anyone with a special need from 15 years and older for information on how to attend or to help out go to our website wjactv.com reporting live in the johnstown newsroom jacqueline kovac six news